Hey everyone, this is AVJV Gaming bringing you guys episode number 11 of this hybrid series. And as you guys can see up on screen, we have a hybrid between the United States of America and Jamaica. And as you guys can probably see, there's a lot more silver players than gold players, which is something I'm trying out at the moment. As I've found out, a lot of silver players are really better than actual gold players. So we're going to start things off, guys, with my goalkeeper over here, Nick Romando. And he is a very good goalkeeper for 1,100 coins. You can't really go wrong unless you guys don't want to spend that on a silver. Don't trust silver players. By all means, try out Tim Howard and uh, Brad Friedel. But our center back over there, definitely the star of the team, is Marvel Win with his 93 pace. And I think it's 95 acceleration so he did stop a lot of really strong strikers Aguero, Balotelli and I think even a couple times Torres so and Dumbia definitely Dumbia he stopped him dead in his track so definitely try him he's a big nightmare for a lot of big strikers and also guys in our midfield we've got a few other good players which is Donovan over there we have Phillips as our left mid and I believe we have Beckerman and Alonso as our center defensive mids and the reason for that guys Beckerman's very good with defending he's got a medium defense rate I think it is and Alonso has got a very good aggressive pace. And also with that, he's got a good long shot as well. So we want to try him out on that long shots. And also maybe he does pull back a lot. So he does help out when you want to go into that defensive mode. And then when you want to go out, he does get those very clean through passes. But uh, moving on now, guys, as you can see, both our strikers have 91 pace, 92 pace, very fast up front. We're going to have Omar Cummings, who's default a striker, and I moved him down into a center attack in mid just to utilize that power that he does have. He's got 90, 85 pace, and uh, he's got very low shooting stats, guys, somewhere in the 60s. But that's one thing I liked about this team is I've actually won the Gold Cup online twice in a row and that's eight games in a row with victories however this team will probably take up a lot of fitness cards as I did have to buy three squad fitnesses they do overwork and that's one thing you'll find with Donovan especially he does probably require a fitness card every two games his fitness does go down to 70 after two games so do keep that in mind guys but uh, definitely try this team out they are very very good but over we're going to start things off with Omar Cummings getting an outside foot shot nothing better than doing that inside the box with a silver player that you wouldn't probably expect to shoot with and this is probably my favorite goal out the lot guys as you can see Omar Cummings here coming around long shot unbelievable stuff from him he's only got 67 long shots according to foothead and 77 shot power so that's something you don't really expect to see from a silver center attack in mid Especially since I converted him down. Main reason for that, guys, is he wasn't very uh, as fast as my other two. And they, they were pretty much deadly. They could take on Thiago Silva, Danny Alves, without uh, without really breaking a sweat. But as you can see, guys, Matux, this is one of the reasons I rate him so highly. And his finishing is so clinical. And as you can see, first touch, controlling the ball. Second touch, it is done. That's like a messy finish straight away. But uh, for those of you guys who don't know, I'm making a few other hybrids. I've got five hybrids ready to get out. And some of them are going to be a little bit costly, but some of them are going to be actually very cheap. So you guys will have a lot of fun with them. And at the same time, I'm going to have reasonable squad builders. So a lot of squad builders at the moment, guys. And that's something to look forward to as I like sort of doing them. They, they're, they're a lot more fun, a bit more creative than just doing uh, nationality squads. So as you can see, guys, we're going to move on to our defender. And I think this one is Pierce's goal. So as you can see, just getting through using manual controllers which is something which is new to me especially because I use semi-assisted all the time. Moved on to manual controllers just in the last couple of days for this actual video and it's actually become the next thing I've actually started using. So as you can see, manual controllers has been helping me out a lot. Getting a through ball to Matix, near post finish, goodbye, it's done. What an assist from the goalkeeper. And he's going to run back to thank the goalkeeper, but no, we're going to cancel out with a dead fish and eventually Romando will come into the picture. And <laughs> that was to no avail. But anyway... Definitely, guys, try out manual controllers. If you are finding Ultimate Team or FIFA, for that matter of fact, kind of a little bit boring, try out manual controllers. It brings the game to life again. And that's one thing I find really fun about Ultimate Team. And at the same time, the controller system. You can play around with that to find how you play the best. But Matux over there, a few step overs. Uh, I think it was ball rolls, actually. And then just finishing the ball very clinically to cancel out the keeper. As you can see, not even facing the goal properly and getting it into that far post, which is an special feature about him. So uh, I think here is another bit. We just tried to do a miss kick over there. Going to go and punish the keeper. Look at that from out the box. Very good finish indeed. He does have, I think it's around 79 shot power. So uh, it's not too bad for him, guys. He's got 61 long shots. And also, he's not the best of players. I'd say he's not the tallest of players, but he is a very good player in himself. As you can see, Taylor getting in the action. And we're going to end it up with Cummings with a venomous volley. So if you guys did enjoy this episode, please leave a like and subscribe. As always, this has been AVJV Gaming, and I'll catch you guys for the next hybrid. But this has been AVJV Gaming. Catch you guys later.